banana como chico, chico Tipo, que atas que hacerlo pico, pico Nudo, pico, mamata, tripo, tripo Bono, nudo es en mi día Es cari, que hacerlo pía Cae que acto en mi metro No slack, pelo lo que alito en el go Pasha, pa' que tan, te relax en mi boca Tipe tom, no, no, no Hey, 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 everyone, how you doing, Miss Carolyn, Miss Annette, Chew, how are you? Hold on a second, y'all, gotta let this YouTube side get caught up to the rest of us over here. Let's see where we're at. Mm. Chew, how you doing? Good to see ya. Hey, y'all are amazing, and you're hanging out. MJ Squirrel, how you doing? Party Pickle, what's up? Hello, and good night, everyone. Party Pickle, you heading to bed? Good night, buddy. It won't be much of a party without a pickle. No. Nah. I sent you an email a little bit ago, Miss Annette, Party Pickle says. Two months old, and he's almost six in July. Oh, man. Oh, I'm missing that. The other season, what are you crazy people doing awake and up? Hmm, that's a good question. Just in time for 22 minutes. Where's it going? Where's it 420 at? Somewhere. Party pickle, I know. But, dude. Without me, Jeff. I'll try to carry on without you, party pickle. It'll be tough. It'll be tough, my friend. But I will do my best. <laughs> Mad cow, I don't know what clock you're looking at, bro. I was trying to figure it out, but, I mean, I don't know. I, I don't even know where that's the time at right now. I tried to look. I mean, it is close to 420, possibly in, I don't know, 12 and a half, 13 and a half. Maybe in some parts of um, the Philippines it might be 4.30 in the afternoon. Or 4.20 in the afternoon, yeah, might be. Hey, Miss Lisa, how you doing? Good to see you. How's everyone doing tonight? Hey, I hope you all had an awesome weekend. Are you all ready for Monday? Are you ready for it to be Monday? I don't know. Seems kind of iffy whether or not I'm ready for it to be Monday or not. But it is, so I guess I'm kind of ready for it. Some place in the land before time. That's Mad Cow's answer. In a land far, far away, there was a Mad Cow. Hmm. Good to see you all. Okay, so what do y'all want to do? Now, here's my question. Do y'all want to do a big race, like a bigger race, like a regular, you know, race item? Like, I don't know. Or do you want to just do something small? Or do you want to just shoot the crap while we think about doing something? That's completely up to y'all. I'm y'all's. So there you go. I'm just going to, yeah. I'm not going to say we can do anything, but, you know. Today is the over-hyped eclipse day. Huh. When's that supposed to happen?
Is it a solar eclipse during the day today, or is it a nighttime thing, or? I guess solar, that'd be daytime, right? Miss Lisa says this evening. Hmm. He says around two central. So two centrals, like three o'clock my time. Hmm. Joseph Lopez, how are you doing? It's good to see you. I hope you're doing well. Thank you, Dev. Matt Cow said three o'clock. Same time when Christ died, three o'clock. Hmm. Isn't tomorrow the day that they're supposed to be talking about killing that red calf or whatnot? I don't know. Y'all might want to keep an eye on that. Over there. In... They got some stuff going on. Yep. See. Well. I'll tell you this, if you're not on board with the man upstairs, if you got a Bible and you have like some kind of questions or doubts about things, and that's why you're not on board, then I want you to go ahead and read. You know, <laughs> there's some scriptures you need to read in there, and then just turn on your news and watch and see what's happening right now. And just, I don't know. Good morning again, Nick Allman in the house. How you doing? So, yeah. When, I mean, it specifically talks about when they sacrifice the flawless red heifer on the mount. So, yeah, going to be a lot of stuff happening. Happy 420, pass a lack of oxygen. Where's it 420 at? Over there, Conzi? So that is a thing. <laughs> kind of, I don't know. I think that would erase any doubt I had if what you're what you're reading in that Bible saying it's gonna happen is happening right before your eyes. So official time. Mm-hmm. Here you go, Conzi. Here, buddy, that one there is for you. All right, so hey, y'all want to see some? Not too long, Jeff. You had it. So, yeah, this is one of my being human things, okay? So, one of the things I deal with in life is, yeah, I have PTSD. And one of the things with my PTSD is it affects me when I'm sleeping. I don't sleep right. I don't like what I see when I'm sleeping. And, yeah, so, so I sleep odd hours. 
Meanwhile, yeah, I ain't got anybody here to keep me busy. I don't have my stuff here to keep me busy. It's just me in a hotel room. So, yeah. I figure I might as well fire up and hang out with y'all, right? Because some of y'all are just hanging out with us, right? So, I appreciate y'all. Where if I was, yeah, if I was like at home and I had my stuff, I'd be busy doing stuff, right? Maybe I wouldn't be thinking as much about firing up. A million times I did think about it, but then I didn't. But when I'm by myself, then yeah. I always need company. Well, there you go, Miss Carolyn. Miss Lisa, because I'm in the on the road. I'm in Tampa Bay, Florida. I'm not in Boynton. I'm not. I'm on the road, ma'am. I'd be weird not to be in a motel room when you want me to sleep outside. No. <laughs> Yeah, I've been on the road since, like, before the first or, yeah, around there somewhere. So, visiting with Jimmy and them, and then, yeah, be heading north, uh, westish, <laughs> westish, yeah, we'll call it that. I'm the opposite, I like being alone most of the time. Miss Net, I do like being alone most of the time. I don't mind being alone most of the time. But I, I like, I can keep myself busy when I have something to do around me. And as long as I have my things, I always have something to do, right? But like, <clears throat> here with me, I have my computers. I have stuff I've picked up with me from the shows and the shop that I have here locally that I have like on my immediate person. Everything else is in the storage and yeah. No. Nope, that's Lisa. That's why I like these early mornings when everyone is sleeping, Nick says there you go. Ms. Nett says yes me too. I do. I like, I mean, I don't know. Yeah, your grandson keep you busy. That's what I mean. You got stuff to keep you busy, right? There ain't much to keep me busy here. I can only watch so much TV, yo. And I didn't go swimming today. So I've just been in, you know, in the room. I didn't walk up and down like the sidewalk thing and walk around the thing because I'm like, oh my gosh. Put a cam and do that a hand. We tell you what it is. What? What are you talking about? How am I going to tell you what it is? How are you gonna... No. Oh. What? Oh my goodness. So, so, see, I'm telling you, hey, there's some strange people out there. So, oh, so. Oh, so, I, I don't know what, I had someone try to explain this to me, and I guess it kind of makes sense, right? That something's happened to them people, and somehow they've turned off the fact that that's, like, wrong. And that's how they dealt with whatever happened to them. Because, yeah, I, I had someone in my life that literally had cried to me about what all this person had done to them. Some horrific things, right? I mean, men that violate women in that way is just something wrong with them. Should should really just be taken out, period, to my opinion. 
pretty sure that that's when we should probably go back to the Old Testament and just take care of it. But anyways, somehow, I don't know, somehow in this one woman, this, this is like a real case scenario, right? Woman stays with dude that goes to prison for, for raping her daughters, you know what I mean? And one of their classmates. What? How do you ever, how do you ever intend on having sex with that man again? How, why would you ever want to stay with a dude that done, did that to one of your children or anybody else, but to one of your own children? I just, I can't wrap my brain around it. So, oh, so I'm, I know that is like, I, I witnessed that case scenario myself. Like I was mind boggled by it because this person had introduced me to this individual and then one day it was like, yeah, that's the guy. And I'm just like, whenever I freaked out, all of a sudden they were just like, oh no, I don't forgave him. You can't act, you can't be like that. And I'm like, well, it is like that. Something wrong with them. So however you forgive somebody, I don't know how you can still be around them or I don't know. I'm I've never had that happen to me. So I don't know. But I think that yeah, I think somehow, I don't know. Because I did, I asked somebody that works in psychology. I was like, what the heck? How could you even, I mean, I don't, I just, I can't wrap my brain around it. So, I don't know. Carolyn said, parents don't believe us. What do you mean, Carolyn? Hey, Carolyn, I mean, the, the court of law believed them, you know what I mean? Like, uh the friend from school that had stayed the night that it happened to to him that all kind of wrapped it up for him so i mean dude went and did prison time for it and chick stayed with him anyways i just i couldn't i mean i could wrap my brain around i still i can't wrap my brain around it i don't know my daughter jasmine comes into the chat occasionally <clears throat> and heaven forbid anything like that ever happened to her but I'll tell you this, she had a young man one time decided he was going to put his hands on her. And, well, yeah, she got a new baby daddy now. So I'm saying, homie, don't play that. And I don't know why all these other parents play that shit. Just saying. That that's that's real talk. So I don't know why parents are sitting by, and uh, women are just as powerful as men on things. But I'm saying you men that are letting your daughters and things get. I mean, holy cow! And yes, there's consequences if you get caught. But guess what? That's part of being a dad. Part of being a man. You're just gonna have to take a chance on it, man. If the law ain't gonna do anything about the shit, you are gonna have to take care of it. <laughs> Cause that's just crazy. And I'm sorry that that happened to you, Miss Oso. And wow, anybody else that's happened to you, I'm real sorry. And I wish I had enough time in life. I'd just have y'all make a list of names. So that at least you'd be at peace knowing it was going to get fixed. Because that's, that's shameful. I don't know what's wrong with our world. Well, oh so, I don't know. One that wasn't thinking right, you know what I mean? That's all I can say. Maybe she just wasn't thinking right at the time, but doesn't make it okay. And ah, that's a tough one. Stick man outdoors, how you doing? Good to see you. Wow. Yep. Tough. Tough subject, but real subject. So yeah. So see, that's a good thing about late nights. We can hang out and just talk. I know y'all got a lot of stuff going on in life. I don't mind listening. Not everybody is, and it doesn't mean that, you know, everybody should formulate their opinion off of that or anything else. So, 
Yeah. Good morning, everyone. How are you doing, Irish Collector? But also, I have seen, yeah, human beings do some pretty different stuff, right? I'm telling you. So, but know this: all that that you've went through is just gonna make it's made you a stronger human being. It's made you a different human being than what you would have been if it hadn't happened. But all them things are gonna be justified one day. You know what I mean? Maybe not here on this earth, but somewhere else it'll be taken care of. And it doesn't make it okay now, but yeah. Hey, Oso. Uh, aren't you in Georgia? I think I gotta go through your way on my way out of here. <clears throat> Send me an email. You say he lives pretty close to you? <laughs> Anyways, I'm not going to talk about it. Let's not talk about it no more. Just send me an email. Remember how I say everything happens for a reason? So there you go. Maybe there's a reason I got to go through there in about six days, seven days or so. You never know. All thing new. That's right. There you go, Mad Cow. <clears throat> All things can be new. You just got to, you know. Start where you're at and go with it, girl. I lived in Georgia for eight years for Benning. There you go. He's on the military base. Very nice. Hey, y'all want to run anything? If you do, let me let me know. I'll put something up. If not, we're just going to hang out and talk. But I'll still put up something cool for y'all to look at if you want. I do kind of like this. I like this uh, Superman. I think they're cool. You know me, I prefer Batman, but Superman's cool. Turn on that light. Dun, dun. Wish I wrote that. <clears throat> oh, so, you know, everything's going to be all right. I'm angry and depressed on the inside. I know how you feel. So am I. So it's okay to be that way. Just got to figure out the little things that make you happy, right? Like all of us in here. And it's okay to vent and get it out sometimes. Like right now, you're venting. You're getting it out. It makes you feel a little better. I'm good with that. I'm listening. If it makes you feel any better at all, it's kind of getting me heated. And I really do want you to send me an email because I really am going to be going through Georgia probably in about a week. In a couple of days, maybe in about 10 days, something like that. Well, actually, less than that. So, yeah, so for sure, you need to send me an email. Don't make me have to go on my pirate ship, look up your address, and then have to try to figure out which one of your neighbors it is. <laughs> yeah, I would prefer you go ahead and, yeah, send me an email. Send me an email, and then I'm going to send you something on that email that will tell you how I want you to contact me. So the other, the first email you send me, I don't want you to say anything about this conversation. Just send me an email. And I'm going to give you another way of being able to talk to me outside of the paper trail way. What up? 
Copper Owl Coins, how you doing? Jeff, are you heading where you used to live, sweetie? Nope, not Missouri. Keep guessing, Miss Lisa, keep guessing. <clears throat> Just got home. Let me get set up. What do you mean, Conzi? Getting set up? Oh, you want to come up? Holy cow. All right. Well, let's go. How you doing, Copper Owl Coins? Hey, you know what? This guy here. Hold on a second. I need to do that. Dang it. Okay, so I've got it. I've got it loaded up. I just don't know how to. I don't know how to it's, copper out. I don't know how to send that to my to my thing. I need to send it to my computer. Maybe. Did I download it into this? I don't know if I did or not. I, I like that blue truck thumbnail. That's just pretty cool. Y'all ain't got to see it. I wish I could show it to you because it's just too cool for school. <clears throat> Did you get your mountain dew, Jeff? No, I didn't, but I need to. Want me to go get a mount? Hold on. It's a good idea. Thank you, Miss Carolyn. I'll be right back, y'all. It's mountain dew time. I suggest y'all go grab a mountain dew. Or water, or whatever it is you're drinking. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Did you hear me rolling around in the chair? Probably so. Uh, I got coffee. No regrets. I'm a little jealous you got coffee. About to go buy me a single coffee maker, man, because this coffee thing here don't work right. Meanwhile, the other place had these little pods that its coffee maker in my room took, so I have not had Miss Tracy Cake's coffee in over a week now. So I'm I'm going through some Miss Tracy Cake coffee withdrawals. I'm not happy about it. <laughs> ah, but the Mountain Dew does help. Thank you, Miss Carolyn. Coffee makers are at Dollar Dollar General for ten dollars. How did you know? There's like a Dollar General right across the street and like a quarter of a block up the road. Like literally, I can walk outside and see one. It's kind of funny. <laughs> I might have to do that. I might have to walk over there go buy a coffee maker just because I'm gonna be like, oh man. I buy mine there, she said. We're tracking you, Jeff. Well, there you go. I mean, it's cool. More the merrier. <laughs> Drop the link. Oh, my goodness. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, 
don't know what that means. No regrets. I don't know what that means, no regrets, and I'm sorry. <laughs> All I have to read is the first part of that sentence, and automatically I know my voice changed, my whole demeanor probably changed, my whole thought process changed. I, I don't I don't know. I don't even know what that means, but Oh, like throwing apples at each other, is that what you were doing? Uh, we used to do that when I was younger. Get the ones that fell off the trees that were softer and throw them at each other. So you can, yeah. I guess that is apple tag. It would <laughs> get hit in that eye. You end up with a busted eye. <laughs> yeah, you got an echo, bro. Yeah. A little bit. I got an echo. You did. Oh Not my! Down, but my headset bit. was uh, cranked all the way up. Sorry, missing that. I I try, but I'm telling you, that's ah, it's one of my downfalls in life, y'all. I'm human. <laughs> and this uh, whole time, I thought you were Batman. Yeah, well, Batman is human. <laughs> you know, you know that's what made me like think of you know that, that's why I kind of of all the superheroes. If I was gonna model myself after one, it would be him because he is just a human being. He just uses his mind, his abilities, and yeah, that's it. Good Money night, to come up Craig. with nifty gadgets. <laughs> good night, Miss MJ. Oh, good night, Gregory. Good night, MJ. Both the mods are sleepy. I appreciate you both. Gregory, good luck tomorrow. All right. I'll be praying for you all. Everybody remember to drop a prayer tonight for Gregory for that doctor's appointment tomorrow. Meanwhile, yeah, just continue to pray for each other about life. Just, just you know what I mean? There is a lot of people in the community going through a lot of things all the time. And I do wish that I had the means and the way to be able to give and do and thanks for everyone I try I really do try but there is just a lot a lot going on in this world a lot going on in our community and a lot going on in other communities in YouTube so just know that you all are in my prayers and thoughts for real all the time every time I say a prayer which is quite often throughout the day <laughs> I get mad and have to talk to God just because I'm like uh I'm going to have to talk to him here in a minute when Kanzi's talking to you about the sentence that didn't even, you yeah. <laughs> know, wasn't even anything, but it just, I'm telling you. Uh. Oh, Jacko. <laughs> How'd you know I was wearing blue, Jacko? How'd you know? Just like Jay Leno. He is, ain't he? He's over there. Look, I'm pretty sure. Oh, no, Miss Lisa. We're about to. Oh, oh, that far? California, right? No, I'm not that far, ma'am. Even though I don't know. Did spend a couple hours down the phone with Tupac. He was like, you know. <laughs> I told him, hold on now, when I'm in Florida, I told you, hey, you're this close, come on down here to Florida and hang out for a bit. Uh, this is the one state he ain't been to, he ain't been to Florida, so, nah. New York, oh my gosh, no, no, north are you coming north this far north? No, no ma'am, no, no, North Cal, no ma'am, no. No, she's in New York City. 
I ain't going north at all that way. Mm -mm. She's in New York. Oh. She nope. put down North Carolina. They, yeah, well, she's in New York City, but. Or North Carolina. Oh, North Carolina. Eh? That's silly. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, right. No, My bad. I'm sorry. But I don't know. I don't think I'm going up that far. I think I'm going to go across, like, to the panhandle. Across that way. I don't know. Cut through Panama. <laughs> and maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, he's gonna hit. He's gonna hit the Bermuda Triangle on the way. You know, wherever the wind takes him, man. Yeah, it's Crumpler nationwide, baby. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> right, Jacko. <laughs> <clears throat> no, I had me and another person had formulated a plan. Is like, okay, so this is the thing. If if you're gonna, you know, I mean, grow in life, you're gonna have to have someone to kind of be there to grow in life with. A lot of times, it's hard just for one person to decide to do things, and that's why I tell people, hey, look, and I try to help people out all the time, and give them a chance to grow, right? Give them that chance to do something with themselves. So. Yeah, so me and someone else had already had been talking and was like, okay, so kind of a fallout plan was, Jeff, you know I am California, so if you do, I'd love to meet you in person. No, I know missing that. One of these days, one of these days, I'm going to come out that way just, just so I can meet different ones. I've been out there before, but I just, right now in life, I don't, I mean, I would, if something happened, I would, if I needed to, I would, don't, don't have no emergencies missing that to get me out there. I just, uh, I've got a lot going on right now. I need you to stay healthy and good and everything be good. And <laughs> Nebraska. But, uh, but no, um. Probably somewhere where, you know, I mean, I already know where, but it's definitely somewhere where I already know people and places and things to where I'm be able to do what I do and be able to get back to things like I can do where I can get back up and get things going again. And yeah, and they can get things going again. And yeah, it works out for two folks that, yeah. Meanwhile, it's hard just to go ahead and say who and where because there's so many other people that draw so many other conclusions. Meanwhile, me and this person is just a friend, period. <laughs> so I'm going to clear that up because eventually everybody's going to be like, huh? And I'm going to be like, yeah. <laughs> Y'all are tripping. There ain't no, no other, nothing there besides just us being friends. But anyways. I'm pretty sure that 99% of y'all know that, yeah, Ella has my heart, like, in her hand, regardless if we can figure out how to be able to make things work with me in Florida. And part of that's just that, y'all, the crazy-ass price living down there is nuts to me. I just I can't see putting that much into having a roof over my head that I can be putting into other things in life. It's just, it, it, it was a little something for me. It's different, right? So, with that being said, yeah, and me and this person have been friends for years, right? Like, I mean, I've went through some stuff that they've been there, and they've went through some stuff, and I've been there, and it's just, yeah, that's just all it's ever, that's probably all, I'm, I'm sure that's all it'll ever been. If, if y'all have ever had a friend like that, opposite sex or not, it's just, we're just really good friends. So, yeah, so me and this person did already rent a place in this other state together, so that's the good thing. Everything has been working out that way. All this stuff's all done. All that's all done. All I got to do is just get there whenever I'm supposed to be there. And Yeah. Huh. Meanwhile, y'all are along with me, so I'm guessing you're going to get to find out, huh? <laughs> Seen soon. Yeah. Make sure to 
Make sure the magnet's in your back pocket, okay? Meanwhile, I think, you know, me and BK, Brian, and the twins was talking today, and possibly this coming up weekend, I think me and him's going to get together, and yeah. Nice, nice. And for sure, I think there'll be a possibly a fourth YouTuber joining us this coming weekend, also. So we're gonna see. Y'all just, uh, I'm telling you, it's an adventure, right? So, as I'm going along, y'all know if I'm close by, you just have to be like, "Hey, Jeff, look, take an hour detour. If I can, I will." <clears throat> I just now thought about this. Let me go ahead and throw this out there real quick for you, pizza guy. Or the the person's name's not Cherie. Okay, I just I just want to get that out there so that you're not right now. You probably already have. I should have thought about that before I even said that while ago. If you're blowing up that poor woman's phone, it's definitely not her. So so you can go ahead and breathe a little. It's gonna be okay. Golly damn. Somebody needs to pump that cat some volumes. For real. <laughs> I don't know what is wrong with that dude, but he definitely needs it to. I know some people that could probably make a small fortune off of uh, talking to him, putting him on a couch somewhere and just. <laughs> wow. But I just, yeah. Because if I hadn't have said that, then I'm sure, and probably still, he's probably still, <laughs> poor lady. It's not Sheree Ward, I promise you that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yep, mad cow. And seeing it kind of worked out because they were looking for a better place and I was looking for, yeah, just a bigger place. and a, Yeah. And it worked out. It just worked out that way. So, yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Meanwhile, it will also put me closer to Missouri for things that I got going on there. And, yeah. So what you up to, Kanzi? What's going on over there in Guam right now in the evening time? No, it's five o'clock. It's five o'clock somewhere. Oh, it's five o'clock somewhere, baby. It's three it's o'clock here. Happen to be no. on Guam. <laughs> so what you been up to? Oh, I had a meeting today. Uh-oh. Uh, so did I. Safety meeting. About four of them. Maybe actually probably five. <laughs> Count that one just a minute ago. And the kids done so. <clears throat> Got a little project coming up. Bunch oh, of yeah. Uh, yeah. Rewire piping. Typical electrical stuff. But they got no power, so they're running off extension cords. Miss Carolyn says it's only one AM there. Oh, they got no power in there right now. They're running off extension cords. Yeah, and uh, the husband is what's that called? He runs off the oxygen machine. Machine. Oh man! So every time she has to fire it up, she everything turns else everything goes off. off. Yeah, just to turn on his machine. So, are you gonna go fix it for him? I was gonna say I know a quick fix to that. Oh yeah, we're running a whole new, uh, a whole new drop, a new, uh, new main coming in. Andrew Northwest, good to see you, brother. New panels, uh, outlet switches. 
Yeah, cool. yeah. I mean, yeah. Redo all of it. It all needs to be redone. If you need just a quick fix, just go buy one break box. You know what I mean? The switch box, and then wire it on each side to where when it's switched, it'll switch it and turn it to where the power is running two yeah, different the, ones. You run two different wires off of it. She can run like the half the house on one and half power. on the other. Yeah. It's she like, can do that off the power cords. It's like 500 feet from the house, the old pedestal. Uh, that sucks. Well, <laughs> see, there you go. God puts you in their path, and you're going to get it fixed, and that's what matters. Shoes. Telling you, it's yeah, stuff yeah, like that yeah. that makes you realize that, you know, my problems really ain't as big as someone else's. I could be in a place like that where, I mean, I don't know. Red, green, of one. Better that though? Yeah. Are, you, are you seeing things? Mad cow, where are you trying to land that plane? <laughs> I don't know. Safe you go the wrong way if you see red green. Oh, Miss Lisa, I appreciate you. See, I've been going live and telling y'all where I'm at. I've been in Tampa now since the first, I believe, either the first or the day before. I can't remember. It's either the day before Lisa. Easter or Easter. I think it was Easter that I got here. You too, Miss Lisa. I appreciate you, ma'am. I feel bad because I didn't remember what state she was from. And I, maybe I should remember that. But there's a lot of different states in my head from everybody's addresses. I'll be honest with you. Shoot, I don't, I don't even remember a few. The rest is like, <laughs> it's in my computer. <laughs> well, and I can probably remember the rest of them. But I got to be right at that same stage. You know what I mean? <laughs> I'm probably yeah, not smoked the same that I smoked. Or maybe I have smoked. <laughs> more than I, I don't know either way i just ain't there i wasn't there whenever she said it, it just it, it missed me when you're doing 20 30 packages every couple weeks it's a lot of things to remember man <laughs> what do you mean every couple of weeks 20 or 30 packages that's like every week every half a week now except for now that i've been on the road and i gotta wait to ship everything when because I just, yeah. <clears throat> you know what I should have done? I should Amazon Prime. Well, no, I'm not going to do that because, see, there's, yeah, no, I'm not going to do that. I was going to do that, and then I was told not to. Uh it's going to ship myself a new printer, but there's already a new printer there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Brand spanking new. I know. <laughs> That's why I was like, why well, early? I'm going to start using pirate ship. I'm like, I know you are. I'm going to teach you. We got this. <laughs> We're going to get you shipping stuff out. <laughs> Saving some money yeah. on pirate ship. But yeah, I just got to get yeah, man. <laughs> Dude. Uh, <sighs> What's yeah. Paying for shipping, holy camoli, man. Oh man. Sometimes it's just not worth using the secondary, <laughs> you know. <laughs> but it is what it is. Tax season. After a minute, you don't want to see numbers. I believe you. I mean, if you're a tax person that's working on them, God bless you. I mean, it's a lot of. Stuff to take in, but you're getting paid for doing it. Meanwhile, if you're somebody that just has to pay in taxes, well, God bless you too, because yeah, I don't, I don't know how they figure it's right because yeah. I don't know. Oh yeah, but Andrew, always have a backup generator if you can, man. Like here on the island, they do load sheds on the generators. Hour, two hours tops, maybe. A lot of places do that stuff now, don't they? Do the little things where you only get so much time or so much. 
Yeah. You know what I mean? The power gets cut back. I think they do that in California. Texas was doing it a little bit. They have that their power they thing. Shut down for like two hours or something. What is it? Uh, go green, right? Hmm. Uh, air pollution thing. Hmm. Well, I think that the only way we're ever going to just go green is if everybody just starts walking again everywhere you want to go. Other than that, you're always going to be using an animal or something else that takes fuel to get you where you're going. I mean, that's the bottom line, right? I don't know anything that just runs on air. Do you? We do. <laughs> no, we don't. Okay. A I balloon. Mean, I can have air, but if I don't have food and water after like, you know, four or five days, it's a bad deal. It's kind Can't of go. a wrap after a week. <laughs> Can't be telling them I used the monkeys. Oxygen is only the oxygen is only part of the deal. That's top secret info, Matt Cow. <laughs> uh, we good where we are. Even though it's power outage, man, it's windy up here like crazy. Very rare we have dead wind days. That's correct. Cows get free air. Now, according to some folks, they're causing greenhouse effects. I don't know if that's clean air or not, sir. <laughs> Cows create a greenhouse. The trees can grow and we can breathe. Don't forget about right. our fishies. We need our fishies. We'll probably grill up some pirate fish tonight. Fish sounds good now. I kind of wish I had some salmon. I, I, I don't bake salmon as good as Ella did. She, she makes good salmon. She makes really good salmon. So, yeah. Toaster oven? No, nah, look here. I know. In the oven oven. What do you mean toaster? Yeah, I know, oven? but what does yeah, that even there's mean? There's a toaster oven there. It's the look here, I'm not doing it here in the motel anyways. <laughs> I'll have it smelling like Hey, everybody's gonna come bitch. over like, hey, what you cooking? <laughs> Are you gonna share or what's up? <laughs> See so you here by yourself. <laughs> yeah. some, see some company. <laughs> What's a man got to do to eat some fish around this bad boy? <laughs> I'm not that friendly. I haven't even said hi to any of the neighbors. I have I've a bunch them. of salmon. We've looked at each nice. other. That's it. I'm just like, oh boy. So you look at it and say 420? Yeah. <laughs> no. Yeah, yeah. Yo, yo. <laughs> Burning Burning that that midnight. Midnight. Oh, oh, Saint says, What's up, Saint? How you doing? Good to see you. Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in to Saint. It's got to be burnt. We figured why not. We just hanging out, kicking it, talking, chatting. Chilling, set, that, set that Superman up there so they had something pretty to look at. What do I do with its little cousin? Oh, he has a little cousin? Yeah. Yeah, he has a little Never cousin. Never knew Superman See. had a little cousin. 
Oh, here, here, here. I do. I got a relative of Superman. There, there's his little cousin. It's his, well, yeah. Right there. I got his friend. Now they can be together as one. There you go. Yeah, so that's the one ounce and then the half ounce. And then you've got their uh, Avenger friend. The one ounce is the right? One ounce is on the left. Superman symbol. The one that's got the Canadian. This one right here is the one ounce. This is the half ounce. Damn, it's a big one. <laughs> it makes the one on the left look like a one ounce or a half ounce. <laughs> <clears throat> Who's he battling? Uh, I don't know what I'm look like, no. cop, bro. What I'm look like a guy in police uniform. This one right here, I don't know. Green Goblin. Could be, I guess. I don't know. I don't know which one I'm a cop, but that one there looks like one. I was looking at oh, it underneath the glass. You got a police uniform. Man against the popos. Uh oh. I guess we gotta bring out Batman. All right, Carolyn, there you go. Hey, so check it out. It's working, though. I mean, it, late at night, though, the internet's good, right? How crazy is that? My theory's right. The internet signal's better when it, when half the city's asleep, I guess. It's okay, guys. Batman's here. He's rolling in to save the day. Is that My the two Batman. ounce? Yeah. You're wrong for that. Anyways, what he's traveling towards Superman? It's a battle. <laughs> so that that five ounce Liberted, is, is that coming from where I think it is? No. Mm -hmm. What year is it? Nineteen, I think. I think. Really? Don't quote me, but I believe it's a 19. All right. Well, if you get it, don't put it up until after I get my stuff out of storage, until after I get to where I'm going, so that I can go through and see if I need mm. that year in that size. Oh, Batman. Because I started Arlen working on a second typeset for the... And I don't know if it's the 19s that I'm doing or the 20. I'm doing the 20s also just because they're a key date. But anyways, that's beside the point in the Libertads. Didn't. I don't know if it's a 19 or a 17 that I'm doing. No, you didn't or get a quarter and half that a half of that. When I let out all the fractionals of the libs I had. Hmm? <clears throat> I said, I don't you remember did. who... I was trying to figure out if you got it, but I don't remember who. But I put out a lot of the halves and the halves, quarters, the one. Oh, yeah, one I think 20. you were getting rid of it. Yeah, you were getting rid of a bunch of those. But, yeah, I got them. But I, I, I don't know if I got any of the ones from you or not. But, no, I've just got a lot. I've had a lot of them. You know what I mean? Through. Yeah. I just yeah, come across them. I tried, man. I was doing good. I had a lot of them. <laughs> I'm always trying to buy and stuff, and sometimes I just run into little groups of stuff. So, right, Gatita? That man in hot <laughs> Usually, when I get them, I, I'll end up getting more than one. And yeah. <clears throat> Got a nice, you need uh, big rounds for Bell. What? I got a what four ounce coming mean? in, Jacko. What does you that know, mean? Like the four and five ounces. She's trying no, to make a, a mad cow bell. <laughs> so mad cow, I've got what you need for that. 
going big. Hey, oh. Matt Count, are you just needing pouring silver? If any of y'all just needing pouring silver, after I get where I'm going and get set up, I have got a bunch of silver that I need to melt and sell. I've got some that's already melted that just needs to be remelted because it's just in big blobs, just big chunks where I've left it undone. Right, Jacko? <laughs> so it'll make good it'll make good silver for somebody to pour and it's you know three nines fine. Lyle so Akimoto. Four nines fine. Good to see you, brother. Lyle Akimoto, how you doing? Welcome in. Good to see you. Man, don't you have that one pound one? Dude, Is I've got you? several one pound ones. That's what I mean. I've got some just right? chunks of Oh yeah, you are the one that showed me that. Copper and yeah. Even the um, yeah. Shoot, you should show him the sack one. I think it's you that has the sack of jewel one, right? Uh, which one? Which sack of jewel? One pound or quarter pound? Something oh, like. that's the one pound. I got the one pound. Yeah, but it's in storage with all the other big yeah, stuff. Yeah. That's what I mean. The things I got with me is what I've been. Grabbing up in coin shops and things here since I've been on the road. Can't carry all that stuff with me. It's in tubs. I've got tubs and tubs of stuff. Like, <laughs> so I wanted to ask chat. Since quite a few of you are in here. Do you guys like me to bring back the bingo balls? <laughs> Which hey. one, the Batman bingo balls or the Batman balls? That's what they call them, the Batman balls. Yeah. What, what bingo, bingo balls, balls are you talking about? One through 100, I think. Remember the one I did? Um, Because I didn't have cards before, so I used the bingo balls to pull the one through 10 in the basket, the whole roller and everything. Very nice, Joseph. Very nice. Yeah, y'all, make sure you sub to each other. Right here, I got it. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Look, we ain't trying to play with your balls, cat. No, what's wrong but you with know, you, man? it's like, hey. I'm like, what's wrong with you, Mad Cow? Maybe a step back from the races. <laughs> you need, right? need a taller what? What is <laughs> Need a roller. Right here, I have everything. And I believe I have one through 100 on the balls, too. Oh, boy. Is this the same one that was shooting them out last time, like six at a time, and then didn't want to shoot one no, no, out? No. Like okay. the one that did come out went flying. <laughs> and I yeah. had to find it. <laughs> like magic balls. Here we go. But it does it does it good now. I can put it in the back and just roll it. He's got a backstop. We're just going to shoot him into a catcher's mitt. Go ahead right and there. put a catcher's oh, mitt damn. up there. Fire them off like you're shooting them out of a freaking uh, baseball Beeple. pitcher. Do I hear a bingo? Do I hear a bingo? Bingo. Hey, we're trying Y'all. to do chicken poop bingo too, man. Come on. We got to get the bingo now, thing that's going. that's where I'm at. That's <laughs> where I'm at. Now, see, everybody else, they got all this old crazy stuff here. There's different ones that's doing this and that with the bingos. But I'm <laughs> I mean, I think I think I had a good idea. I think Mad Cow had a good idea, and I think I helped it grow into a great idea. So I think we got that if we could just get you on board. I mean, it's yeah, hard for me to have course. chickens here in Tampa in the motel. You know what I mean? I mean, I could probably because there ain't no telling what all else they got going on in here. But I'm just saying that I don't know. Of course, I got Mad Cow says I have one. You have a chicken poop bingo pad? Why ain't you already sent it then? <laughs> <Yeah. Casita. laughs> what? So, right. they, they want a full inspection. They want a full inspection of the balls, okay? Okay, One, well, there you go. Huh? Two, three. You got you. Oh, there goes number three. He went flying. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay. Found him. Found so, him. 
Hey. Oh my goodness. No. Bio Okamalo. How you doing? Good to see you, my friend. Welcome in. Welcome back. <laughs> well, let's experiment. 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 Okay. Look, I ain't doing anything strange for some change. I don't know. Kanzi seems to be hey, down, yeah. but I ain't. Hey. I ain't judging. I'm just saying. <laughs> how many's in? How many's in the room? Hmm. I can't see that. Not enough for that to happen. Oh, what are you talking about? The Miami's in the chat. Well, there was 17 until you asked that, and then two of them disappeared. It is they good for that. They went to go get some more people. Well, so now there's, about, more than now there's about to be 20 of them in here. No calling your friends. No I don't know. They already did. Two of them went <laughs> out to go get the rest of them off of like found the marriage channel or wherever else they're at. <laughs> oh, fudge sickles, man. <laughs> Y'all just popping out of nowhere. What the hey? Yep, see Irish collector seen it too. It was 17, then dropped to 15 instantly as soon as he said that. <laughs> That's okay. Give a minute. They'll be back with a couple more. We'll hit 20, and then you can do whatever it is you're going to do. <laughs> Crazy part is it'll be one of the five that come in late. It'll be the one that wins. I'm just going to be like, dang okay. <laughs> it's morning there now, Irish collector. There you go. Right here, right here. Wait one sec, brother. <sighs> they ran to find their bow, Miss Carolyn said. Okay, I got uh -huh. one through twenty in there. Let's go. Get your numbers in there. One through twenty. I can't put it in chat, guys. Oh, hold on, I can. Hold on, why didn't you tell me to do it? Hold on, y'all. Hold on, hold on. Wait till I put it in the description. Hey. I got you. The only way you guys are going to see my balls. One through 20. Is if you win this 1979.25 cent. That's all it takes. Get your numbers in. Let's get it, fam. What you doing here, buddy? Since they want to hang out with us and chill with us, let's give them a Juliana Koning Gender Netherlands. Hey, any of you all? 25 cents. Oh, nice. That is very nice. So any of you all that's in here, that's into vintage silver bars and or Canadian silver bars, if, if you're into that kind of thing, just let me know in the chat, and I've got something I'll show you. I'll offer you. But, uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. It's something I picked up here at the coin show the other day. It's definitely Canadian. It's definitely vintage, and it's it's got a really cool tone to it. It's, like, got a blue on one end, fades out into just normal in the middle, and then the other end is starting to get the same kind of tone on it. It's going to be interesting. Nice, nice. Pretty cool. Get your numbers in. One number only. If you pick Put multiple, it right there. Easy. One. Watch him go. What? I gotta redo my. Oh, rat! Don't do the rat. All for wrong. the balls. All for the balls. All for the balls, boy. Here we go. All yeah, that's somebody's balls. gonna clip that. You know, Kevin Rose just clipped that three times. I'm gonna do clip it. Clip it all, somebody my friend. Clip it all. Clip it, clip it, send There's it to Steven's me. Steven's cousin, Kylo Ren. <clears throat> oh boy. Say hello to everybody. <laughs> oh boy. Got him lurking in the back. <clears throat> okay, everybody, we're going to start counting this down. If someone can put a stop sign in chat, please. In 10, 9, 8, 7, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Shut them down. 
Thank you, Tita. Okay, I can't really see chat, guys. But if you have multiple numbers, please retract the ones you don't want. If not, we are going to go with the first number that you pick. And I'm going off of StreamYard side. Right under Jeff's 1 through 20. There it is. Somebody tell me when to stop. Oh, I can't even see the bottom of chat. Mm, the bows. The bows. Huh. Did they say stop? Did they say stop? Oh, yeah. Yeah, they stopped it all right. And they're playing with the bows. They're oh, there he goes. He jumped. We got a jumper. We got a jumper. I knew it was going to happen. He didn't have the catch remit up. You see what happens? You tell him. Look here, man. It's like sex in hey. class. B11. He done had B two kids before he figured out how the first one happened. Do we have a bingo? Do we got a bingo in chat? Right, scrolling, 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 scrolling. Oh my goodness. I don't see 11. I see you scrolling. Okay, I don't but see you number 11. Rolling. That's it. Okay, Rolling out. No 11. That. Roll it again. Rolling, 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 rolling. Oh, hey, you know what we should do? Oh, my gosh. I should. I ain't got the stuff well, with well, me. I do have, maybe. I don't know if I have the stuff with me to do or not. Maybe. Uh, never mind. I got, I got we'll do it. we'll do it another time. Oh, he goes jumping again because I went so slow. We got it. B9. B9. Do we have a bingo? Is it a bingo, y'all? Good luck. Any bingo in chat? Bingo in chat. No oh. oh, bingo. I see a bingo. I, I see it. Bingo! Right Mad right Mad Congratulations, Congratulations Mad Cow. brother. Rigged! Okay, while well, we got it rolling and flowing, brother, let me write you down real fast. Let me find it. To the side. Let me pull out one more. One sec. One sec. Yeah. I got this cool looking one. Right, Gatita? Khan's got them balls, baby. <laughs> yeah. This next one, we'll just go off the same, same amount. It is the Republic of Italiana. What? What? What did I do? Oh, okay, hold on, brother. Yep. Little Conzi wants to wants to chat with you. He got the joke to tell you guys. Hey, little Cons, how you doing? How oh, yeah, Hi, Mister Jeff. Hi, how you doing? Good. Good, good. How's school going? I didn't went to school. You didn't. You didn't go to school. And you yeah. can't tell everybody you're skipping today. Oh, <laughs> that's okay. <laughs> Gotta have a day off every once in a while. It was my but dental. It was my dental today. There you go. Got to take care of them teeth. Hey, I got a joke to tell you. I got a joke to tell you. How many tickles to let a octopus laugh? How many tickles does it take hmm. to how make many... an octopus laugh? An octopus has how many legs? How many legs does an octopus have? It's tentacles. Tentacles? How many tentacles does an octopus have? <laughs> no, he said it's tentacles. <laughs> <laughs> Tentacles. I get it now. He's working I on the punchline, guys. He's working on the punchline. I got it. That is hilarious. <laughs> Tentacles. I get it. Oh my goodness. Okay, cons where I put that. Okay, here we go, guys. Got a cool looking foreign. 500 Leary, I think. Oh, snap. He even has a. 
Look That's hilarious, right? Tentacles. I get it. That is hilarious. The punches and the coin for the blind people. That was nice. That's That's cool. I was thinking spiders. <laughs> there he is. Stop thinking spiders. Why get me uh, thinking about scary spiders for? Okay. Good luck, everybody. Tell me when to stop. Perfect extraction. Can we get a bingo in chat? Do I hear a B8? B8. Can I get a bingo? Can I get a bingo? <laughs> what did we get this time? Where did we go? Who hit it? Little cons, can you tell us? Can you tell us who got it? Did anybody get the number? Andrew? Andrew, Andrew Northwest Coins? Andrew First Northwest number? Coins. Are you here, Andrew? You got to speak up. You got to be here to claim it. We've got four less people in the chat. Where's the chat at? Okay. Andrew Northwest Coins. It's a boy. Right, Jacko? It's, it's a boy. <laughs> and down the chute he goes. <laughs> Andrew Northwest Coins, please speak up. Brother Andrew, are you here? Andrew, I don't believe Andrew's here. You go. Andrew, we're going to give you to the count of five, four, three, two, one, and we're going to roll it again. Good luck, y'all. Sorry, Andrew. On to the next. Good luck, everybody. Get the stops in chat. Get the stops in chat. Tick tock, tick tock. <laughs> See Carolyn with the stop. B fourteen. Mm. B fourteen. Can I get a bingo win chat, please? Twins. Bingo. Matt Cow said there's twins. Oh, there is twins. Okay. Oh, see, there we go. I told you. It's, it's fitting out doubles now. We're going doubles. Next time it'll be six of them. Here we go. B4. B14 first. Uh, B14 first. Oh, sure, sure. How do, you know who's front? Oh, so. How do you know who's front and back? They well, got shot the out of there. So. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. I take the first uh, qualified mm -hmm. uh, individual down the chute. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So Gatita won. Okay, Gatita. Mm -hmm. Where's that at? This is yours, ma'am. Add this to your wallet. Congratulations. Please put that back in. It's suspect. Isn't and can it? I no, get a B4? It's suspect. Do I hear a B4? B4. Oh, boy. <laughs> Please put How those about away. B after. Don't touch these. Do not touch these. What are what are you looking at there, Junior? Busting out the slabs. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's the good stuff. Miss Annette, congratulations, Miss Annette. Let me pull out something for you real quick. Hey, if you want to make your dad a PCGS lover, go put all the slabs in the deep freeze. And then about two days, go in there and just twist them real hard. And then show him the ones that come apart. <laughs> like, look, Dad, I put the, all the nice ones in the dance go book. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't even have to crack a slab. I just went there and twisted them. They fell apart, Dad. Missing that? But it'll, it'll be, be cool. Getting... You'll still have all your PCGS ones. Your a NGC one peso. All come apart. From Republic of D. Columbia. 
1975. Add this to your wallet, Miss Annette. Congrats, congrats. Okay, thought I was getting Pimp Batman, little Pimp Batman. Oh no. You know what he's doing with that Batman? Is he's torturing me. Because I don't have that Batman. And right now, I, I, I just can't get the Batman. So he's torturing me. Batman? I don't see Batman. Where's Batman? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Batman's not here, guys. I don't know what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. You guys are crazy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. Tita's and missing it. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, and I'll just tell who I have wallets with. Miss Annette, you have a wallet. Good Tita, also, you have a wallet. Huh. Miss Carolyn, you have a wallet. Crypt Keeper, Papa C, Dove Season, Brother Gregory Freeman, Brother Jimmy Snowdog, and Jay Slokes. I will be doing shipping this week. I usually prep by Thursday and drop off Friday or Saturday. So if you would like me to hold a little longer, just let me know. Yes, ma'am. So. I will be sending. What's this 20 grams over here on the left? That is a vintage 20 gram Canadian bar. Pretty cool, huh? Mm. It comes with a picture of me attached. Big love, Mad Cow. Good night, brother. He says, I gotta watch the sun. Prayers. Catch you later, brother Jacko. Big love. Intermission while Cons gathers his balls. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, I read that one, didn't I? Oh my gosh. Well, gotta, it is what it is. Get him while it's hot. Get him while it's hot, baby. <laughs> well, we didn't need to know all that. Now that's that's something else. Now, now he's got hot balls. He's having hot flashes, y'all. He's going through that change of life or something. I don't know what's going on. Ah, oh, crap. Drop that small coin. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Did it go? Mm -hmm. right, that's what happened playing with your balls. Ah. Mm -hmm. Holy crap, I found a different one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That is not the coin I was hoping earlier. <laughs> I don't think you're playing with your balls. You're a little too far uh, south. <laughs> you're digging coins out. That ain't normal. Oh, dang it. Oh, my goodness, y'all. What do you think? <laughs> and that's how the one-tenth went missing. <laughs> Story of my life, guys. Story of my life. <laughs> oh, my hey, goodness. I dropped the 25 cent and I picked up a one franc. The heck is going on here? <laughs> <laughs> and you dropped a one cent. <laughs> and the Something's wrong, man. Something's wrong. <laughs> Oh, man. 
It's no yeah. vacuuming for a while. <laughs> oh no, that's the fun part. Just go ahead and vacuum. It'll sound like popcorn. You'll know you got it. you hit gold or silver, <laughs> whatever it is. Oh man, got gold. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> uh, you're talking about twenty dollars off its value every penny year. <laughs> Ouch, 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 ouch. Stop the vacuum. No. Oh, man. In right, Jacko? <laughs> yep. I know. My drawers are in the pool filter. I get. I didn't go swimming today, Jacko. I thought about it, but I didn't. I was going to, but then I didn't. But, yeah. Miss Carolyn's in playing slots. I don't do good with that kind of thing, slots? man. I don't like losing. It makes me mad. No. You got to play the big machines, and you got to go look at the numbers. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. I ain't got all that. I ain't got time for all that. Yeah. You got to play the machines that have been played, not the machines that haven't. Just look at him. I know it looks weird and sus, you know, walking around looking at all the things, but hey, it's your choice of where you want to play because that is your money. So get those big jackpots. Oh, Khan's bringing out the big ball. <laughs> Oh, the coins were falling out. I was thinking slots. <laughs> hey, I do know this. I figured this out a long time ago. That you go to the casinos around about three o'clock in the morning, four o'clock in the morning, two around the you know, two, two thirty ish on down to there. People that are out front in the lobby thing looking really sad and depressed and upset. <laughs> If you strike up a conversation with them and notice they got on jewelry, most of them have probably already had a bad night and they will sell you whatever gold or silver they may be wearing. <laughs> See, I'm that guy. That's what I'm, <laughs> when I'm at the casino, I'm just like, well, let's see. Pawn shops are closed. Hmm. So, yeah. So if y'all are at the casino... You, you want to bump into somebody like me because I'll buy it on site. Like, I mean, I, I carry an earth magnet with me and I know how to read well enough to be able to kind of guesstimate what it is. And I'll, I'll give you something for it. I know. Good night, brother Jacko. Get some shut up, my bro. Yeah, I was like, huh? Done. Got to start prospecting. Waiting to hear that the bro Jacko. Oh, bro Pedro, good to see you. I've been in contact with Donna, John Al's wife, MLZB, and I will be hosting a fundraiser with John Al's family to keep him his funeral expenses. Details coming out tomorrow. All right, Pedro. Thank you for letting us know. There you go, y'all. Very nice, very nice. Pray to Brother John's family. Yeah. Prayers to the family for sure. Good night, Brother Jacko. <clears throat> Good night, Jacko. Big hugs, brother. Yeah, 
Yep, Miss Carolyn, they do, and everybody tries to help out and do in their ways. It's just crazy to me how, how, how things, I don't know, how things happen so quickly, I guess. Is, uh, I think it's just, yeah, never enough time, never enough time. So, yeah, got to enjoy the time we got, right, with each other and make the best of it. Very nice, Pedro, very nice. Very nice, very nice. So, hey, what are you going to put up there for us tonight, Kanzi? Your hand? Oh, man. <laughs> thought he was running. He's got balls out there. And that's all he wants to do is play with the balls now. See how it that's is, Pedro? Small, you know. See how it is, that's Pedro? Get Kanzi up here. He started playing around with balls. Now that's all he wants to do. You're not 12 going on 13. Get out of the bathroom. Quit playing. What, what do you got going on with that Kit Kat bar? What is this? What do you got happening in there? Yeah, you stuck it, it away. <laughs> you bingoed it in the hole. What's wrong with him? No one wants to play with my balls, then. Fine. I'm about reading palms. Look at this. <laughs> My brother having more brain surgery. Oh. I've been so worried. Prayers, He's prayers, is Carolyn. Oh my goodness. Yep. Prayers for him, Miss Carolyn. Oh, no regrets says. Oh, I thought he said no more. He says more balls. We got you. We got you. You can put a hundred, hundred of them in there if you want. You know. I'm gonna camera up. Focus. Focus, young Padawan. Focus. Move my balls out of the way for a sec. Everybody's getting distracted. Put Jeff's friend up here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Put two ounces up there. Hey, one of y'all need to go ahead and buy that off him. Win it or something. <laughs> That way I don't have to see it anymore and think about it as much. And, you know, it makes my brain hurt a little bit when I see it. It does. It hurts a little each time. Oh, yeah. Yeah, put it back there in the back. That's it. I can't see that at all. Get this out of the way. Make sure no one sees it. Make sure no one sees it. There we go. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. Down goes the ball. Down goes the ball. You guys, I keep my balls in order. What happened? Whoa, hold on. Thought we were gonna keep your balls in order, guys. Hundred is more than my hands can hold. Um, um, Option, I was so hundred. I need to. I need to. Race my to cat's race. been chasing balls all night. <laughs> Kanzi, stop running around Oso's house. <laughs> He goes on the tenth for his next report. Mm. Hope all goes well, Miss Carolyn. And for sure, on like the ninth, come in and remind us so that we can all be praying on the tenth as well. Please, pretty please, because you know.
see, I've got this kind of busy stuff going on tomorrow. I got to start figuring out how to get the gas, electric, and the internet turned on in the next, in this week from here all the way to there. So I'm working on that. We're going to work on that this week's mission. So that way it's all on. Yeah. Huh. Pedro. I'm missing chat, missing chat. Right, Oso? Stacked in rack. <laughs> oh, no regrets. Got them volleyballs. We see, we see. Sizing up, I see sizing up. Hmm. You know what they say about big trucks and big softballs. Yeah. I'll up my uh my ball. Here we go. Oh boy, here we go. Just a little bit bigger than the other one. Just a little bit. Yeah, ain't no wonder why yeah. no ladies ever come hang out with us up here. Yeah. See this? All this guy wants to do yeah. is play with balls. Yeah. See the ball? Um, <laughs> we, we don't want to see your balls, man. It's getting weird. I got my eyes closed. Is it safe yet? What's he doing, y'all? <laughs> need someone to tell me out loud. I can't hear you. Can't hear okay, you a bit. Okay. Is it Let's safe? Put the ball away. <laughs> Okay, one more, one more ball for good luck. One more ball for good luck. One more ball for good luck. Good luck, Matt. Go ahead and edit the show. One more ball for good luck. Right there, right there. It fits in the palm of your hand. Then like no a reason, I'm gonna go back in and have to change the edit the show. To, <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe Kazi showed us his balls. Uh. <sighs> Y'all are crazy, man. What are you guys thinking? That might be an idea. I wonder if I can do that right now. Clip it, clip it, TikTok that back. Hold oh, no, on, this is stupid. <laughs> Let me try it. I'm going to try this. Clip oh, it. Gosh. Clip it and send it. Full send, baby. 100. He said full send. 100. I don't think you got it in there. <laughs> Ain't a man in your family. <laughs> they got you, got you, Oso. I'll toss them balls in your Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Earl Grey and Lipton are both clues on what he's doing with his balls. <laughs> Pedro. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Hey, hey, I don't know. I don't know what you guys thought. Conzi wasn't even here tonight. <laughs> that little green guy is the one that stole the blue truck. Yeah, it probably is. That's probably the one right there. Conzi's right. not even here tonight, you guys. You guys are, shh. I was never here. Just remember, I'm Batman. How do I edit this thing? I know how, but you shine the light upon this situation. We got more gibbets today. Ooh, some cool gibbets. We got a poo bear, dinos, a clock. Very cool, very cool. <clears throat> I haven't showed this in a while. Any glass artists out there? Or people that like glass?
Say hello to my little alien friend. Crush opal eyes, UV activated. All these lighter greens you see. Focus, young Padawan. All these are UV activated. By JB, made in 2020. Oh, found the ball again, Jeff. Found it. Look at that. Look at that Keith Scooper. Well, this is actually a dab scooper. <clears throat> Cool pieces, cool pieces. Can okay, we see chat? So junk. Catch you later, vote for Pedro. Good night, brother. Oh, see this says them not balls. But I see a Paul. See what else? Let's see what else? What else does Conzi have on this table? What's that for the news? <laughs> no regrets. <sighs> Look at that dab tool, baby. That's a scoop. Ah! Um, dang it, I forgot what the... Jeff, are you here? Maybe step away. Ah, I was going to ask him when the gold specimens, what's that coding it? I forgot what uh, mineral. Hey, what do y'all think about the title and the stream now? Oh, there he is. There he is. Jeff, the huh? um, specimen. Did you see the title of the show? I can't see you. The title of the show is I Can't Believe Con Z Showed Us His Balls. <laughs> what? <laughs> Look, I got another one. Huh? Six dry. Oh, Tell me, I'm getting bigger. Gosh. Just wait. Just wait. I'm getting bigger. I'm getting bigger. I'm getting big. Just wait. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, my gosh. Wait for it. <laughs> The balls keep getting bigger. Everywhere balls. Yeah, is this for action? Jeff, I see you, Jeff. Right there in Florida. Uh, not, we well, see yep. you, bro. Yeah. We see you, dude. We're keeping our eyes on you. Got you. I got the whole globe in my hand. I know oh, where boy. you're at. <laughs> See what, but uh, anyways, you know, hey, specimen. He's got an, what is he's got the an specimen? obsession with balls. He went from little bitty ones to great big ones all of a sudden. What else you got going on there, cons? Here you go. Truth's coming out. He's got some. He's gonna just start grabbing them out of everywhere. Got some crazy things going on, guys. But um, the specimen that you're getting from. Mm. Right, no. What is, what is the rock on the outside? What is that called? Uh, it's called a rock. No, what you're talking about quartz. Is what gold quartz, is yeah. generally <clears throat> inside of. Is what it veins inside. <clears throat> it's quartz. Yeah. So this is this is quartz. This is made out of quartz. Nice. Yeah. So this is what. All the dab rigs you guys see, the one they dip in water or they dip in alcohol to clean it. Ones like for the high heat. Yeah, it won't shatter on you. So right. this is made out of quartz. 
so you can heat it up and it won't sh won't ever shatter on you. Allegedly. Oh no, I did it, bro. That's how I always clean my rig. Right when you're done, you dunk that straight into the alcohol. Cleans it right out. Man, I can see that I did put this one up before. What'd you get there? This is actually a pendant. Oh, yeah. Yeah. The UV activated. So all this right here will glow when the UV light hits it. This is Crush Opal Eyes. As you can see. You can see some of the UV uh, stuff on his. Kind of like an alien head. Kind of like an alien head. Well, dang sure ain't a person. Better looking in hand, you know. What do you all think? You think that's a person? Let me know. Yeah, this is full glass. JB's on Instagram. You can check out his pieces. Right there. JB2020. We're just going to get a hold of you. I'm be like, hey, Cotton Z. Oh, he don't have this. He only made, um, if I'm not mistaken, 20 or 30 for that year. And that was it. Yeah. For the pendants. Yeah. They do very limited runs when they do glass work. Especially the heady pieces, those big, you know, certain, even like the eight inch bongs and whatever like that. Dude, those things carry a high premium, man, for glass work. I have a request. Upgrade me to a duffel. Throw everything you have. <laughs> God, Dina. Thanks. Sorry, guys. I catch chat. Like, I have to click on the comment section in StreamYard, hey, and then I can't see my screen. What would I do then? <laughs> <laughs> I think she's talking to you, Khan. She's been talking to me. I know. <laughs> okay. Like, there you go. I don't want to see his ball on screen anymore. <laughs> send it all. <laughs> Just go ahead and send it to her. She'll take care of you. I got you, so. Also, if you are into. So, the hey. Pieces and the quartz, just let me know. Just email me. You got my email. So them vintage Rolos, it's crazy, man. I'm looking at prices on some of these things. Go for sometimes they go for hundreds of dollars. That's nuts. What, what is wrong with people? Mm -hmm. Did no one look this up the other night? Whenever I tried to bend it out for like forty five bucks. Um, not no. many know what that is. That's like a, a collector of it, or like vintage collector would know Swiss of America. Because right when I saw you put it up, I was like, oh, that's the original makers of the Rolo right there. <laughs> and shoot, I couldn't even get my hands on one for less than 40. That's for sure. It was all 40 plus, 40 plus shipping, 40 plus shipping. Then the real nice ones. Whoa, whoa. Then I even, I even came across um, a 10 ounce Rolo. Mm. Never said that'd be cool. <laughs> <laughs> they said you couldn't have it back. Okay, so what we doing? I don't I'm know doing... what you want to do, Oso. We're just hanging. Talking. I mean, it's four in the morning. I'm probably about to, you know, end up turning into a ghost. Fun to hang out with y'all and visit and show some things. So we've just been hanging, visiting, showing some things. 
I can run something if you want. But it's up to you. Nothing hanging. Nothing hanging. Yeah, the Rolo is pretty cool. Although I think that vintage piece was pretty cool too, but yeah. You know me, I do like vintage stuff a little bit, so just so y'all know when you see one of those. If it has this on the back of it, you want to pay attention. Original makers of the Rolo. Yeah, the reckless Rolos you guys see. The Swiss of America. They have their original Rolos. And boy, when I came across that 10 ounce, man. Whew. I wanted to, but you know. <laughs> Oh, I'll so we'll get to where we're like running more things later at night. I'll do some things, you know what I mean? While I'm figuring out stuff, because then it's more daytime for Conzi, so then I can do more. But just tonight, just want to hang, just testing the waters, hanging out with y'all, seeing what's going on. Yeah. I appreciate you. I appreciate you coming up, Conzi. So I wasn't up here by my lonesome. Cause yeah, then I'm just gonna start trying to sell stuff after a bit. And I've been like, uh, yeah, I don't want to hear me talk. I don't like hearing but myself also, talk. I don't. I don't like hearing my voice. But huh? Never know. Just put an ounce up there. <laughs> I mean, you can. That's up to y'all. I mean, not that ounce. I can do that ounce. American Silver Eagle. 1992. It's Ooh, toned. It's toned. Been loved. I'm a night out. Daylight. Scary. Right? But I gotta get some stuff done tomorrow during the day too, so... I'm burning both ends of the candle. I know, Gatita, I caught you on a... Uh, what channel was that? They were doing box break for the Pokemon. You won, but you I think you fell asleep. <laughs> what? You waited like five minutes. You kept calling your name. It's like, Gatita Oso, please speak up. <laughs> She, I think she joined, uh, she jumped in on that uh, box battle some guy was having, or a pack battle, and she won one of the slots, but she didn't speak up and so she re-ran it. But he waited mm. like a, a good three to five minutes. <laughs> right, Katina? <laughs> Who are you collecting Pokemon for? Little ones? <clears throat> So I got a lot. Well, I mean, I know someone letting go a lot of the high end uh, collector ones. PSA 10s. <laughs> and I know a couple signed one by the artist. Oh, bro. Those Good cardboard things. I like free man. stuff. Oh, it's pouring. It's a pouring. Raining. Yeah, raining hard. Yeah. Stay inside, dude. Pouring out there. <clears throat> yeah, little Kanzi collects uh, Pokemons, and then my three little ones do. They collect the pops with me. Not yet. Oh, yeah, so, oh, so. 
I've got some. Oh, garbage, garbage pill kids. Pill kids. I've got some garbage pill kid cards. They're in Missouri, but I've got some. I asked if they would sell the tins. Man, some of them, some of them do. Some of them, most of the those streamers will turn around and set it online because they, they will sell the tin for like five, ten bucks or something like that. And it depends on what's on it. Makes it more, you know. Just like silver and gold, you know, they have their premiums. You know. Miss Carolyn has Pokemon cards too, she said. Nice. Nice, Miss Carolyn. Collect them, Miss Carolyn, or the little ones. They they have an app. <clears throat> you can download the app, and it'll give you uh, well, let's just say, ninety percent of the Pokemon on there are like worthless, you know, dollar whatever. You pretty much are going after the hitters. I am a tin collector. Oh, oh, Gatita, I do have. Let me go through Konzi zone and can send you pictures of what tins he has. I think probably has like six or seven. Wow. Yeah, I like tins too. Oh, so. <laughs> I would show you something, but I don't know. Not yeah. Hey, some people have their fancy. Like, look at this tin. It's huh. me, a Mario. <laughs> I have to bring you the rest of this one. To you show ain't you. the only one. Let me, let me show you this. <laughs> I'll show you part of this tin. Here you go. See there? Ooh, cookie Monster? It's cookie, cookie Monster. Monster. The rest of the tin's holding something else. You see there? Whoa. whoa, whoa. That's not cookies, Jeff. That is. Whoa, whoa, oh, whoa, could... whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, whoa, whoa. that could be Girl whoa. Scout cookies on that tray. Could be. <laughs> could be. Probably not. That's probably OG For dog. Any market. kids that want them. Oh. I have $125 one greedy. Nice, nice Miss Carolyn. Wait, Miss Carolyn. They are highly collectible. That's for sure. Cookie Always Monster check them. Good tin. Always check them. Scan them. All the hollows, scan them. First edi if it says first edition on there, keep them as clean as possible. <laughs> yeah. Just like how, same like silver, when silver, when the first American Eagle came out. 1986. That's one of the most expensive American Eagles you're going to buy, even just for the basic and circulated. And then 10 years later, yep. they cut the minage of it, made it a little low run, and then that made that one expensive. Same goes with those cards. <laughs> the very first one they made, oh boy, how much they cost. You can buy a house. You can buy houses. Yeah. Keep them all in holders and sleeves and dry. I have a Burger King collector Pokemon card. Nice. Nah, <coughs> all of them hold their own value. Uh, it goes by the way they, kind of the way they grade a coin too, so to speak, you know. Scratches on the edges, the centering of the print. Same like a dollar. You know, the basic dollar. You can tell if it's off by a little like this. It's to the right a little because the left side's a little wider. Same how they grade a card. And then there is collectors just like coin collectors. Or what's that lowest grade, Jeff, that they do in a slab? Hmm. Uh, it's some, I can't remember the name of it, but it's pretty much, it's a button. You know what I mean? It's just blank. Yeah. It's, it's worse than coal. It's something. Golly, yeah. I can't think of the name of it. There's a group of collectors that go after those 
the junkiest grade ones or something like that. I forgot what yeah. it's called. But yeah, there's avid collectors of all different kinds. It's like 69s. Some of them just like collecting 69s only. Still in Burger King sleeve from 2010. Very nice. <clears throat> Nice. All right, wild man. Call it night, brother. For it's a hey, no. Hold on, I was just getting ready to announce. We got two minutes. Oh. And then we got to bring it in. It's four twenty. <clears throat> Y'all get ready. So race or I should know so says so which is it gonna be <laughs> Hold on, hold on, hold on, get in the bong, get in the bong, get in the bong. So happy 420, yo. And guess what this month is? This is the fourth month. So guess what? You only got a four, few days before 420 will be here. Eh. Okay, guys. Prepping for my 420. Prepping for my 420. Hey, yo, so why don't we run an auction on it? So it's a 1992 American Silver Eagle. It's got some awesome natural toning going on with it. Of course, it's been, you know, it's got a little mark there on it. Ninety two is not a semi. Starting bid thirty five dollars. I don't have free start option, I know. I'm sorry. I don't have it in me to run the races this late though. I gotta get some sleep here in a bit. See if I sleep for like three or four hours and I can get up in time to start my day and be doing things I got to do tomorrow. Got a million phone calls to make. And then I might pop up tomorrow during the day sometime. But for sure tomorrow night. What happened? What happened? Oh, what man. happened? What happened? What happened? I almost what happened? passed out. Passed out. What? Wrong with oh. you? You know, you know. No, I don't know. <clears throat> Just... Time. Time for me is now. It is past four twenty. What time are we on tomorrow night? 9.30. I always go at 9.30 on Monday nights. Before then, I'll be over at Miss Mia's Coins hanging out. Hopefully, I'll have time to. I always try to. Mm. 
Nine twenty two AM over here, the Irish collector said. Nice. Good morning, my friend. All right, yo. Gun Z. Hey. What? You sound like a robot. Yo, yo. You sound like a robot, man. All right. I'm going to have to wrap this thing up, brother. I just want to let you know before I hit the button. <laughs> no worries, no worries. All right, y'all. I appreciate y'all. Remember this. God does love each and every one of y'all. Thank y'all so much for just hanging out with us tonight. We didn't even put anything up, but that's cool. We just got to hang out. We got to talk. Got to know each other a little better. Thank you, Oso, for sharing with us. And so sorry you had to go through all that, but just know you have people that are behind you now. So. Snow that yeah. Everything God God makes things happen for a reason. Things have a way of working themselves out eventually. God just keep believing that. We appreciate y'all. Yep, no regrets says sleep well everyone. No regrets you get some rest too, my friend. Miss Carolyn, God bless you, ma'am. I know you need some sleep. You lay down and get some rest. Even if it's just a couple hours, it's still some sleep. So I'm going to take that advice myself. Meanwhile, y'all, remember to keep your heads up, your feet down. Keep reaching for them stars. Keep on stacking that silver. I'm going to give you all some videos to run this thing down. I'll see you all later on today. Bye. <laughs>